This segment of Delmarva Life is brought to you by Delmarva Dental Services. Well, just before the break, we learned just how many of us rely on prescription drugs. <laughs> many of us do. Yeah, and that means many people also suffer from a condition that can be caused by those medications. It's called dry mouth. Dry mouth can be very uncomfortable. It can even be painful, but it can be treated. So joining us today to tell us more is Dr. Joseph Harmon with Delmarva Dental Services in Salisbury. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. Glad to be here. I'm going to ask you a really basic question right out of the gate. What is dry mouth? Well, it's a pretty dry subject, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so dry mouth is uh, when you have a chronic mouth that's dry, a uh, fancy word for it is xerostomia or hyposalivation. Right. It's basically you don't have enough saliva. And, and you yeah. actually have an illustration of what it can actually feel like with dry yes, mouth. Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> that um, is a, a desert in like the mouth. The de like a desert in the mouth. Not to make light of the subject. Yeah. yeah. But I mean, a lot of people have it, right? Yeah, uh, one in four. People suffer for, from it, and if you're over 50, it's 40 percent. 40 percent of the people suffer from it. Is that really? right? I didn't know that. Well, what causes it? Well, the main cause is medications. Yeah. Prescription medications specifically. In fact, three of the top 10 drugs, the most popular top 10 drugs, cause dry mouth. Is that right? If you went on, I went on a list uh, to find a list of them, and there, there was like 16 pages of medications that cause dry mouth. Well, it's usually one of the, when they're doing the uh, disclaimers at the end of the prescription drug commercials, it's one of the first side effects you hear. Most of your blood pressure medications mm -hmm. and most of your antidepressants and your de over the counter, your decongestants, yeah. your antihistamines. Hmm. Very, wow, very, so this is very, very common. common stuff. And the more of them, I guess that could make it even more complicated. Multiple, it? multiple, multiple wow. effects from it. All right, so aside from the obvious, what are the symptoms of dry mouth? Well, uh, dry, painful, burning mouth and tongue. Mm -hmm. uh, you have difficulty uh, eating, especially dry foods. Uh, difficulty swallowing, uh, speaking, mm -hmm. like, like now. <laughs> 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 uh, um, and bad breath is ah, another thing. Okay. Ah. And if you have a denture, um, it's difficult to wear a denture. It hurts, right. gets sore, because the saliva is a lubricant. Think mm -hmm. about it. Now, sometimes when I'm outside <laughs> and maybe I'm doing something, chopping wood or something, I, I, we just pretend I really don't do that. <laughs> but anyway, um, I, I'll get a dry mouth. It's like a cotton mouth. I just got to go inside and get something to drink. How do I know when it's just cotton mouth from what I'm doing or, or it's dry mouth? Well, that would be an occasional thing, whereas dry mouth you have all the time. All the time. So if it starts out, I might mistake it f thinking it's cotton mouth, but it really is if dry mouth. You drink mouth. water and you stay hydrated and it goes away. But if you're taking medications, then you suffer for that, from that all the time. It's chronic. And the good it's news good. is chronic dry mouth can be treated? Uh, it can be treated. Um, basically, you want to drink uh, water, mm -hmm. uh, eight ounces of uh, water a day. Mm -hmm. um, another thing is um, they have some wonderful um, lozenges that right. melt over hours. And you should use sugar-free ones, of okay. course. And if they contain xylitol, that's even better. Right. What is xylitol? Xylitol is a sugar. It's made from uh, birch bark or, or corn. Right. And it has a wonderful effect in that it inhibits bacteria from sticking to things. Oh. So Ooh. it makes bacteria fall off your teeth. It makes back. You can use it for sinus rinse. Hmm. You can cook with. Well, you can cook with it and mix with it. It's an It's not artificial. It's actually a natural alcohol sugar. Good stuff. And artificial saliva. I saw that on the list. Yeah. There's artificial saliva that, that you can buy. Um, there's, there's a lot of wonderful products coming out now. Um, there's toothpaste, uh, saliva, there's a prescription artificial saliva mm -hmm. uh, that you can get. And there's medications that um, you can, uh, we can be prescribed uh, mm -hmm. that will make you, the that'll help you stimulate saliva flow. Dr. Joe Harmon, thank you very much. Great information. Yeah, I don't know if you knew about you. all that. Well, if you'd like some more information about Delmarva Dental Services, all you have to do is go to delmarvalife.com and click on that show tab. Well, still to come on Delmarva Life, many people across Delmarva are getting pumped for Firefly this weekend, including me, yeah, this, this girl. Right here. That's just one major music festival across the country. Up next, Jack Osborne, the son of rock legend Ozzy Osborne, joins us to tell us why music festivals are increasing in popularity. Plus, we'll find out how he's adjusting to life as a new dad. A little bit later on, a lot of us are firing up the grill for a backyard barbecue this time of year. We're in the kitchen with the secrets to make sure it's a successful one. Del Marta Life, we'll be right back.